Hello, you, John. Hi. How are you doing today? I'm good. So, what are we going to eat today? So, today we are going to eat Yunnan cuisine. You know, basically, Yunnan is located in the uh, southwest part of China. Isn't Yunnan uh, next to Vietnam? Yeah. And Laos? As well as Myanmar. Very interesting location, yeah. isn't it? Okay, let's go, shall we? So, let's go. what it's going to taste like, but I'm going to give it a try. It's, it, it's nice, it's nice. I would personally give it seven, 7 out of 10. It, it's not very strong, it's kind of, it's, it's kind of weak, but it has its own flavor. This area here is Yunnan. This place is right next to Vietnam. Laos and Burma and it is down southwest southwest of China so the first dish we got this it's a Yunnan chicken soup there is an order of eating this food waiter told us we need to drink the soup first and then we we'll put the chicken into Doya Yunnan tofu Oh, that looks really nice. The flower, roses. Rose bun. Oh my god, it does smell like rose. This bun smells like flower. And I've never tried any bun that smells like flower before. So I'm very excited to try this out. It looks very nice. Can you tell us about this fish? I have no idea. I haven't tried it before. Oh, you so you just hasn't tried it as well. Smells like rose. Mm. I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Wow. This Greenland dessert, very delicious. I'll give it a 9 out of 10. This dessert is the, one of the best Chinese dessert I was there, I'll say I have ever had. How do you like the food? Um, it's good. It's splendid. What would you rate it? Um, personally, my favorite food is tofu. Tofu? Yeah. It's, it's a bit creamy, and um, this tofu is unique. I have no idea how to express the taste exactly, but it's a bit different with Hubei tofu. Okay, we just finished our food, our Yunnan cuisine. Uh, I'm very full. And I think my favorite food is both the, uh, the rose bun, which is not here anymore, it's in my belly. The rose bun is my top, my favorite. Second is the uh, dessert. Yeah, the dessert is very nice. Third is the chicken. The Yunnan steamed chicken. We are going to eat dinner at this restaurant called Our Home Dongbei with our special guest. Please introduce Mr. Dasha to us. This is Big Chef. Big sure, big sure. Oh, I can't speak English. My okay, English is very poor. That's it. Oh, yeah. So you John, please introduce to us what dishes do we have here? Start with this one please. Only vegetable. 
is made from well eggplants, potatoes, and green peppers. Do you know how to cook this cuisine? Um, no, a little bit, but I don't know how to describe the name of this dish in English. Okay, you fine. can try it. I don't know. Yeah. How does it taste, Big Chef? It's okay, but I think um, I like the spicy food, so it is not spicy. It's not spicy enough. It's not spicy at all. I don't like this taste because it's not spicy. This, this little freak is just kidding. Yeah. Let me try it. What's, what's this? You know? This is what, what's this? Dumpling. Huh? Dumpling. Dumpling. What, what's the stuff? What's the stuff inside? I don't know either. Okay, I'll try it out and I tell you what it is. Do I dip it in there? Yeah, dip it in. Spicy sauce. Well, this is spicy. You like spice? This is spicy. Mm, <laughs> I, thought it's, I thought it's shrimp. But it's like Chinese uh, tomato uh, scrambled, scrambled eggs with tomato. It really looks like shrimp inside. So I thought it's shrimp. Yeah, it's alright. I'll give it. Because I have never tried it before, I'll give it a up ten. But if I now I've tried it, the second dumpling of this dumpling will be seven out of ten. That's a potato. It looks like potato wedges from Domino's. Mm. Oh my god. It, it reminded me of my primary school canteen dish. In my primary school, our canteen would make this kind of potato which is, yeah, it reminded me of that. So I'll give this, I'll give this seven, seven out of ten. But because it, give, it makes me feel nostalgic, I'll give it eight out of ten. You say it's fried pork? It is fried pork. That big shot. Do you know what this reminds me of? Uh, I don't know. You know, Japanese uh, fried pork. But this one is um, Chinese Northeast fried pork. The coating outside it reminded me of uh, tempura. But well, I think tempura is uh, very crispy. Yeah. 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 Crispy because this one is harder. Yeah, it's harder. Stickier. Stickier. The texture is interesting. The pork is alright. This is chicken. <laughs> this is chicken? Alright. My bad. My bad. Okay. I'll give this 7 out of 10. Okay, we finished our meal and Big Sha, what do you think of the Zhongbei cuisine we had today? Um, well, I think it's okay. But at first, I think um, the, the kind of dumpling will be very disgusting, you know, because the, it is made from potatoes and eggs. I think it is quite strange, but, but after I mm, taste it, it's okay and it tastes very very good because the texture is very um, well surprising. Mm, that's it. Mm. I think uh, all the are delicious, especially dumpling. But we finished. <laughs> then why are you pointing? You're pointing at nothing. Thanks for watching this video. If you like me or him, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.